Hey, so I'm banging around in Steve's place. I've got my expedition up in the air and um, getting ready to pull some plugs out of it and do a few more things. But well, it's kind of a new truck to me, so we're looking at the end side of it. And right now, we're going to check out the fluid in the transfer case. So, we wanted to show you guys how to do that on the expedition if you want to take a look at it or change it. So, Steve, what, uh, what would we recommend with this? This is, we're going to pull the plug and we're going to see the fluid condition. We're going to stick a dip. Uh, a tie wrap in to see if we can see the color of the fluid if it doesn't leak out on its own um, and if it does look contaminated or brown it should look pink if it looks brown I would suggest we use like a, a full um, synthetic on it this is overlooked a lot of times regular 3-8 ratchet fits right in So we have a white tie wrap, we use that as our dipstick. Who do we have? Yeah, it's a little dirty. Is it? Yeah. Is it? Seen worse. Yeah. It's not brown, but it's not pink, pink, pink either. Okay. We'll probably suggest uh, at some point remove the drain plug here, drain it, and they probably only t they only usually take a little more than two quarts, two and a half quarts of uh, the full synthetic fluid, and that'll help with the temperature. The synthetic fluid lets it go to a uh, higher temperature, so it protects it better. So that, that bottom plug will drain it out if you need to drain it. And then you put the bottom plug back in and then you refill it obviously by the top right there. Uh, you refill it until fluid starts to come out. And then You can get the quart up on an angle or you can use a suction gun to fill the transfer case again. Yeah, the suction gun, uh, we showed it in a different video. It works pretty good. You can pick one up at your local auto parts store. It's like a tra uh, fluid transfer suction gun. It makes it a lot less of a mess. So if you had to fill it up, you would just fill it up um, until the fluid starts coming out of that top yeah. spot. Yeah. Hole. Yeah. Then you put the plug right back in, tighten it back up. You don't have to crank down on it, just make it snug. Right. And uh, we'll tackle this another day. We just kind of wanted to check it out while we had our truck up in the air. Right, Steve? Yep. That's it. So at least we know now. Yeah. Do another video for you guys.